Ever notice the bizarre unit of measurement on the Massachusetts Avenue, better known as the Harvard Bridge, called Smoots? Well, they come from 1959. There are some MIT pledges who are trying to get into a fraternity. There's a senior who says, it's really cold in February when I have to walk from the Boston side of the Charles River to MIT on the Cambridge side. I would like you pledges to measure the distance of this bridge, but not in feet, not in meters. I want you to do it in, and he finds the shortest one of those pledges, a guy named Oliver Smoot. He's only 5'7". He's not like tiny or anything. He says, I want you to measure in smoots. So the kids go out there, they take some string, they measure Oliver, and they start measuring the bridge. The senior walks up and says, what are you doing? I said to measure it in smoots. They say, we are. He says, no, you're measuring in string. They say, what do you want, Oliver to lie down and we put a chalk mark over his head every five foot seven? The senior says, exactly. It, that bridge is 364.4 smoots long, plus an ear. I don't know if you've ever tried to get on the ground and then up again 364 times in a row, but his muscles were floppy noodles by the end. He grows up and in a thing that you cannot make up becomes the chairman of the International Organization for Standardization. That's the organization that makes sure that we do not use crazy measurements like a smoot.